Brian Wilkes is Managing Director of Franchise Concepts Limited. Brian, you are an established consultancy. What can you tell me about your services you are offering to potential franchisors? Yes, we're one of a, a small number of specialist consultancies. There are probably five or six in the country. We, uh, first of all, help the franchise or company to establish what it is they're offering to their franchisees. We would put together for them their prospectuses, the license agreement draft for approval with their solicitor, and all of their financial projections that are necessary to offer the franchisee, and then help them to submit their package for National Press Association approval, help them with their manuals, training courses, all the way through, and then we also are involved in helping them in their selection of franchisees. So this means that you in fact appoint franchisees on behalf of the franchisor? No, in fact that's one thing that we very definitely can't do. What we have to do is to always make sure the franchisee and the franchisor are in mutual agreement that they want to have this partnership, this marriage together. What we can do is to save the franchisor's executives having to travel all over the country, perhaps from Scotland to, to, to the south of Cornwall, to arrive at a situation where they're meeting people that, who aren't suitable. We can cut out all of that, we can do the groundwork for them, but ultimately the two parties have to agree that they're both coming together in the way that they wish to. Understand that now I see on your stand here you have the complete cook shop among your clients. Uh, is that uh, an established uh, franchise? Yes, Complete Cook Shop has been uh, operating now for about four years, and before that, the uh, proprietors were involved in, in the same trade. They've, in fact, been in that business for over 10 years. Uh, we'll be shortly opening our 20th. Uh, shop. Approximately half of those are company owned and half are franchised. And it is uh, a very popular type of franchise because it suits ideally the husband and wife team. The technology is fairly low and the profit margins are very high. Now, I also understand that you're involved in the export and the import of uh, franchise projects. So, what can you tell us of this? Yes, we have um, a client, for instance, in Spain where we're developing with them a chain of uh, bridal wear outlets. Uh, we're just about to appoint our 100th franchisee in Spain. Um, and we've also worked with uh, companies in Germany. And we've helped foreign franchisors to bring their franchise packages into the UK. For instance, the Cookie Coach. Uh, franchise is one which we introduced and uh, issued the master license in the UK. Now what about the future? Do you see any new franchises uh, coming on the market in the, uh, say, the next two years or so? Well, I would hope very much that we'll continue to see a development in retail franchises. Uh, unfortunately, the property situation in the UK has tended to hold back the development of retail franchises. Um, I, I would hope if we could overcome that difficulty, franchisors unfortunately tend to have a reluctance to guarantee the property premiums and uh, the leases for their franchisees. And I think until more franchisors are prepared to do that, as we do with the cook shop, um, it's not really going to develop. What is the main ingredient, would you say, that a franchisor has to offer? It's the fact that the package is proven. I mean, uh, as you can see here at the exhibition, franchises can cover every possible conceivable trade. Unfortunately, many franchises are offered onto the market before the base that it's established on is really proven. I think providing the base format is working properly and thoroughly, then almost any type of franchise can work successfully. Thank you. Now, this being the second day of the first ever National Franchise Exhibition, how did your first day go? Well, I think everybody was astounded at the number of people that came on a, on a Sunday into central London to visit the exhibition. Um, we're here in, in two roles, one obviously with our clients distributing material for the public, but also, of course, we're interested in hearing from new franchisors. I think probably today and tomorrow it'll be more of the latter, whereas Sunday was the day for the public. Thank you very much indeed. That's Brian Wilkes, Managing Director of Franchise Concepts Limited.